So I want to show you probably the best mouse trap I have ever had. And we live out in the country, so there's a lot of tiny mice that get into the attic and uh, into my shed and into my garage and underneath my outdoor kitchen. So I have about six of these buckets um, all around the house and uh, around the property set up just like this. Got a stick coming up here where they can walk up. Uh, got some kind of spinning device here with peanut butter on it. And then down in the bucket, I fill it about a fourth of the way up with water. And you can do it with antifreeze if you want them to uh, dissolve and die, die a little quicker. But um, if you don't put water, they'll jump out of the bucket. Or if you get more than one mouse in there, they'll kill each other. It's kind of bloody mess. So if you just put water, they'll drown. And it's simple. Just flush the bucket out, dump it out, put some more water in. The peanut butter lasts a long time. It lasts months. And you don't need it to update it very much. And you just keep changing out the water, changing out the water. And uh, this one here I bought on Amazon, this spinner. But you can do a coat hanger and a Pepsi bottle, work just as well. Um, but basically mice, they come up here, they run around on the edges, they get out here, they eat some of the peanut butter, then they get greedy and they come off to the side and then they just boop, fall in the bucket. Simple. I probably caught 50 mice with this type of bucket. Um, and it's uh, probably the best thing going because it you can make it for just about nothing. Those little spinners you can buy on Amazon. I'll, I'll put the link in the description. Uh, pretty cheap. and uh, But you could do it yourself with just a coat hanger and a Pepsi bottle if you wanted to. But uh, I like those spinners. They just pop in there perfect. They got a little bearing. Spin real nice. It's easy. Easy to load the peanut butter. Easy to clean it. And uh, that's about it. Hope that helps. Have a great day.